And OK, here we go. Today I'm going to do a playthrough through some of, through one of the safe work uh, puzzles in my latest game of Familiar World, which will launch in January 2023. And yeah, I'm going to comment a bit about the game in general and uh, yeah, I'm probably going to vent my frustration when we are getting to one of the harder puzzles in the end. Okay, we're going to work ourselves our way up from easy, medium to hard and probably advanced and the expert we are going to skip because they are actually really, really hard. <laughs> okay, let's jump right in. Start with puzzle. Okay, the first one is easier and it's uh, recommended to uh, actually work yourself up from uh, all the way from easy to uh, um, upwards in the difficulties because uh, if you just jump into the hardest difficulty you have no idea how the puzzle is going to look in the end and you can get a general idea with uh, um, uh, in, uh, in just a few seconds if you do the easy route because now you have a general idea of how things are supposed to look. Okay, this is easy, I'm going to finish the puzzle now and it took me 39 seconds. That's actually pretty long for an easy for the easy mode, you can bring, at least I was able to bring it down to 20 second and seconds on some puzzles. Okay, what can you say about this game? So it has five different difficulties as you can see and it's uh, getting progressively more frustrating. One of the, one of the things that makes, makes this game quite hard is that uh, it uh, doesn't have any uh, it, it, it's uh, perfect squares and they don't have these puzzle things that connect into each other so it's it's actually it it's going to be very frustrating especially on expert because expert doesn't have a five pa five on five field it has a 20 on 20 field and yeah that's going to be fun I implemented uh, achievements for the people that uh, want to showcase that they have a very high pain tolerance <laughs> because uh, one of the achievements is uh, to uh, finish 20 puzzles on expert mode. And that's actually not that easy <laughs> because you have to go through a lot of pain in my eyes. <laughs> yeah, okay. What else is there about the game? Well, it's it's not a safe work game. It's not a safe work game. It just features some safe work images, like you can see here, that I can safely post on YouTube. Oh yeah, that one was right. And uh, by finishing these puzzles, you can unlock scenes. Oh, this one doesn't fit really well. Fit here. You can uh, unlock scenes, and uh, that's that's a way. This game even has a story. It's not just merely a puzzle game, it also has a bit of a story. Okay, something I did. Probably that one. Okay. You can see it's only the second difficulty. This is the standard difficulty, by the way. And it's getting hard to see whether or not you have the puzzle pieces on the right spots. And I can guarantee you there are other puzzles here that will be way harder to figure out because they have more they have less details in some areas so that's that's actually not that easy so it's it's a bit of it's a bit tricky okay you can see i took about twice the time for the medium difficulty let's see how long it takes me on hard i did this puzzle on hard i never did a puzzle on advanced <laughs> yeah okay let's get into it okay Let's talk a bit about the story element of this game. It's uh, um, uh, yeah, you play you play the uh, puzzles, you finish them, and uh, if you finished like six puzzles with the same theme, then you can unlock the scene that's connected to these puzzles. There's only one puzzle that doesn't have a scene connected to it, so that's quite fun. And these uh, scenes can range from not safe for work scenes, <laughs> which uh, this game includes, all the way to uh, the safe for work scenes like, no, this one isn't a safe for work scene, this is just a safe for work puzzle. But uh, there are one or two scenes that can be viewed as safe for work. 
Okay, here I'm going to need to uh, construct a fox lady. <laughs> and I'm not sure where she is standing. I think this piece needs to be here somewhere. Okay, this, uh, this one seems pretty good, uh, which means I probably have to move these ones down. And I can... Oh yeah, this has to go to the left, I think. I hope I remember correctly. Do I remember correctly? Maybe. This one seems right. <laughs> At least the feet. Okay, this one can... It, it's probably going to take me about five minutes to finish this one. <laughs> But that's okay. Mm, this one has to be moved down. But I don't think they should be moved down, which means I probably mess something up right now. Okay, we'll find out soon enough. <laughs> okay, let's finish these characters because the characters are actually easier. They have some detail, I can uh, find the pieces for the characters pretty easily. One of the things that I know is that I'm a developer, so I know how the images are supposed to look. <laughs> Maybe that's a bit of an advantage of mine. <laughs> Maybe other people will struggle a bit longer with some of these puzzles. And uh, it's not the first time I've finished this puzzle in particular, because um, I've, been on, I've been at this for a while now. Okay. What else is there? there there's something for her. Okay. <laughs> is there anything else? Oh yeah! This game is actually not just a standalone game, It's uh, it can be played as a standalone pretty much. But uh, the story of the game is uh, the prequel, prequel <laughs> of uh, Vienna of Mine, an adult Vienna again. <laughs> it's uh, called A Familiar World. And uh, yeah, okay. I don't. I don't really want to do a deep dive into the story, but uh, let's say it's pretty fun, and it's going to release in February. So <laughs> I hope this uh, can. Yeah, I don't know. I probably will do a bit of an. Uh, <laughs> what is it called? Uh, it's going to come to me. Where you sell both games for maybe with a discount of ten percent if you buy both at the same time. So. That's pretty fun. Oh yeah, the, both games will be on Steam. Hopefully. I had it in this one. Uh, I'm hopeful that uh, Steam won't will allow it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Here we have some grass. Grass is easy. We know where grass is supposed to be. Then that's a face. <laughs> okay. We, we, we still need a bit of a uh, tail of a fox. That's this one, I think. Okay, upper left corner. Can we get this? No, I have no idea. Okay, five minutes, that was a very optimistic guess. A very, very optimistic guess. Very black. Is that the... Mm, this might be something here on the right side. This one is way too bright. They're way too bright. They're parts of this image that are way too bright and I think they are that way because they have to be placed below the campfire. That would make sense, especially because the depth of field on these images is pretty high so it's closer to the camera. Okay, these two seem right. Yeah, that that's it, that's it. Now we're, now we're going anywhere, somewhere. That's good. Okay, now... <laughs> That's as far as it goes. Here we have something else. What about uh, the background? Okay. This doesn't seem right. This That's good. That's pretty good. Okay. Here. Uh, no, that it, it doesn't fit. <laughs> doesn't fit also. Here we have another bit of grass. Oh, that... That's good. Okay, this is another character here on the side. We already know that because we finished the other puzzle on a less difficult difficulty. Okay, here we have to build ourselves from the edges because I have no idea. I would have to guess where these bright areas are. 
Uh, yeah, that's uh, <laughs> that's just trying things. And this one seems right. I don't know. I'll leave it there for a second. The good thing is that we don't have to uh, rotate these pieces. <laughs> that would be very, very frustrating. Oh yeah, you can replace one piece with another one, as I just showcased there. This one, a lot of depth of field, so I knew it ha has to be placed near me. Very dark, yeah, that's the thigh. <laughs> okay. What else? Uh, shouldn't there be a head or something anywhere? I think the head is just a shadow, so this won't help us very much. <laughs> These two seem very similar. I, I'm surprised that they don't match up very well. Okay. Let's... Oh, that one seems right. <laughs> this one doesn't seem right. Let's keep trying things until we finally match it, finish it. Oh, this one, a lot of depth of field on this, uh, on the grass. Okay, I'm not going to do any harder difficulties. <laughs> you can imagine how they will play out. Oh yeah, that seems right. What about the upper left? Didn't we have the upper left already? <laughs> yeah, okay. I have to admit that puzzle games aren't my speciality. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, other more experienced players will probably get this time down to three minutes on this difficulty, but I doubt that anyone on expert difficulty can actually go below 20 minutes or something like that. I w it wouldn't surprise me if someone who wants to do an expert difficulty has to... Oh, this one seems false. Uh, <laughs> that's frustrating has to do about an hour or two hours to finish a puzzle. But expert difficulty, you only do that if you want to brag. One thing that I can mention is that if you want to unlock these scenes that I mentioned earlier, you only have to finish every puzzle on easy difficult or on at least one difficulty level. So that's pretty doable. <laughs> but I did get some some feedback of for from people that only want to know a bit about the story and don't really care about puzzles all that much that uh, they were too frustrated to finish a single puzzle <laughs> or to f finish enough puzzles to unlock a scene and the easiest scene to unlock has only one puzzle but uh, the others have at least two puzzles that you have to finish before you can unlock them this doesn't seem right so uh -huh. It's, it's really just trial and... Oh, yeah. Mm, of course there isn't a face. This is just the hand and here's the... Yeah, here's the second leg. Here's the first leg and here's the second leg. Okay. But I think we're getting... We're getting closer to finishing this one. Which uh, I'm happy about. Because this video is probably going to be a bit too long. Or longer than I expected. There it is. Okay. I think that's it for this video. I'm uh, going to upload a few of those over the next couple of days because I'm going to release the game in 20 days from now on. It's the 21st right now when I record this video. I'm not sure when I will release it. I'm probably going to upload it to, still today. Yeah, okay. Anyway, if you watch it right at the begin, uh, right when I uploaded it, I'm... Uh, then there's Christmas coming up, <laughs> and I'm going to wish you a happy Christmas, and we'll see each other in pro hopefully another one of my videos. Okay, have a great one. Goodbye.